So how we doing guys? Welcome, it's Kraken here, back with Overcrowd. So I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode that we did. We had a very nice basic station that we had to get opened up. And now we've got two stars on that. Now we need to research more, learn a bit more, so then we can jump back and turn this into a five star station. So we can now look at the next place is in the network. Now, we're actually not connected to this one up here, but we are connected to Port End Avenue and Wrangler's Corner down here. So we may as well just jump straight into the middle and have a little look at this Port End Avenue. So, let's get cracking. Cuckle doo 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 once again. Right, here we go. So we've got a completely different looking map this time. Look at this, we've got a longer fin map and we've actually got an entrance for a track down here on the second floor and we've got some, yeah we've got an entrance from the street down here. Right, so let's have a look, what have we got to do for this one then? So this time we have to build two platforms, not just the one platform, but we've got to actually build two this time. Now we've got a choice of three platforms that we could potentially make here. We got one here, one right next to it, and then we got one down here. So we need to do that. We need to build at least one entrance and hit the footfall target. So that's only got a target of two commuters. We got one down here, a target of three commuters. Okay, so we'll probably definitely do the one up here on the on the ground level to make life easy. And then we'll probably use, we've already got a bit of plat, a uh, bit of um, building here. So we may as well turn this into a platform and hopefully give ourselves a bit more room. We made ourselves a bit cramped last time and then work our way downstairs, unlock the uh, escalators or staircases, whatever they've got for us, and then work on this platform going left to right down here. So... Let's get um let's get some flooring, get ourselves started. So if we're gonna come in from here, we made the area yesterday where you get the tickets from quite small. So let's build ourselves out in this direction a little bit. Make this area a little bit bigger this time, I think, will be the the way to go. So if you come in and turn straight up there, let's get a entrance in just to get things started there we go so we've got our closed station now which one of these platforms do we want to use i think we use this second one here because we want to give ourselves a bit more room they did feel crowded so let's give ourselves a little bit more room here and get ourselves the platform in once we get the platform in we can see what we're dealing with. So that's a max of three carriages. Well, that's more than big enough to fill up the footfall for two commuters there. Right, let's... Yeah, let's definitely enter from that side. And this time, what I think we're going to do, we need to get the turnstiles in, which are here, level one turnstiles. So you can see everything that we researched in yesterday's episode is still actually there for us, which is really good. So we've got the light bulb straight away. We don't need to reinvite, reinvent the light bulb, the uncomfy seating, the plants. Because we're going to be making two entrances this time, let's put three, three of those in. We're going to have two platforms, so let's put three of those in. Let's quickly configure those. So we've got this one here is going to go to platform one. This one here is going to go to platform one. And this one here can be the exit. There we go. Now, let's make this. Yeah, we've got a problem with power because we know that. Well, let's put some fencing in. To now block this off. Um, oh, okay. Can we sell that? Sell that piece, yep. Okay, I like the way that you can sell things and you get the money back. So let's put the fencing in all the way down to there. So we're going to keep it nice and open. If we make this just a little bit bigger. 
we go right up to the platform. Yes, we've got to be careful because obviously we've got this bit down here and you can't build on top of it. So let's get rid of those two rows, actually. Get some more fencing in for us. There's our fence. There it is. And we'll put that in there. Right. So we've made this area a bit bigger than the area we made yesterday. Now we need a ticket machine. This time we're definitely going to need two ticket machines. So we'll put one there. Um, yeah, one there, I think. And we'll put a bin in. Because people were complaining they couldn't find a bin yesterday. So we'll get one bin in nice and early. Right, let's have a little look at our rooms. Because we need to get those in. We haven't got very much money left. So we're going to have to get this place open. Pretty, pretty sharpish. Right, this is a lot bigger than yesterday. We're not going to make the platform length any longer at the moment. Because we don't really need to. So, get this a little bit bigger, and then let's get our rooms in. So, we're going to need a tall room again. And if we make that to there, a door down there, and we need to make the utility room. Now, I'm not quite... Oh, I want to make that a little bit bigger, actually. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, you come down to the same side, because we're probably going to need a lot of generators in this place. So we've got a bit more room here than we had last time, so hopefully they won't feel so crowded. And what are we going to do next? We need to put a staff room somewhere. I'm thinking the staff room we should put on this side. In fact, can we make that? Because I didn't do that in the last episode. Some people did mention that in the comments. Yeah. We didn't actually change it so you can enter from both sides. So now we've made that you can enter from both sides. We can put a footbridge in. There we go. And that is where we're going to put the staff room. So we'll put the staff room. Oh, we need to put the floor in first. Just build this a little bit bigger. It doesn't need to be very big. There we go. And that's where we'll put our staff room into here there we go staff room doesn't need to be very big beautiful very nice right let's put the things in for the staff first of all because if we can't keep our staff happy we're going to have issues big big issues uh yep and a water cooler keeping them hydrated because we know how important that is there we go beautiful now we should be able to no we need I thought we could open no we need some generators utilities cool we've only got two thousand left are we gonna how many generators are we gonna be able to have let's get two generators in one fuel can and we'll get one wheelie bin in at the moment we're gonna put just the basics in we need a jerry can Yep. We need a toolkit. We need the lit litter picker. I'm going to leave the watering can off for a second because we don't actually have any plants in yet. Let's get ourselves opened and then we can get a member of staff. Now that's already complaining about power with two generators in. So let's have a quick look at our staff. Oh, we've only got one we can pick from, so there's not really... Oh, that's from our last one. Right, okay, so we, we can take the staff with us. There are currently no staff on your roster that are on shift. I've just put her on shift. Oh, so she has come on over with us. Oh, that's good news, because she was a good little worker. Okay, let's get another generator. Is that going to give us enough power? Let's unpause the game. Here comes Chloe Clark. There we go. So let's just wait for some people to come on in. We have got a little bit of money, so let's...
I want to put a chair in. Where were the chairs and stuff? Here we go. So, right, we're just about to hit rush hour. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. Cool in the train. And let's get a level one bin in for them as well. So Chloe Clark knows the drill here. Oh, we've already unlocked the two carriages, so that's nice. We've got the footbridge going over as well. Now, you don't seem to be doing a lot at the moment. Let's just make sure that you still have all your settings. So, yep, filling up, repairing and picking up litter. Obviously, we haven't got any of those at the moment because we have only just opened. But we've got some litter. No, this is just... These guys buying their tickets down here. Yep, people are coming through. Right, so let's put that megaphone down here again to move people into this area. Where was that megaphone? That Yeah, the PA system. How are we doing for money? 1,200, so not too bad. Let's put you... Yeah, we'll put you in there. Oh, you're struggling for power as well. No, maybe that's just because I just put it in. Right, let's get this next train in. There we go. Just get things ticking over nicely. Our money's down to 860, but we are getting quite a nice bit of footfall here, which is good. Eight people have come off. Come on, keep on buying those tickets. We've just got ourselves... A few more bonds by the sounds of it. Now, why have you not... Ah, now you're going... Now you're doing something, Chloe. Ah, we've actually... It looks like litter, these minus ones. So why are these people unhappy? So you're going to go and grab yourself the litter picker. Let's close you down. And let's check our report. Gloomy, that's right. We need light bulbs. Silly me, that's why people won't be happy. get our lighting in this is going to cause us issues right we haven't got the power oh here we go there we go put another one of those in i've never known a light bulb to take so much power before come on in you come don't want people being late Put a light bulb there and a light bulb there. Can we get away with one in this area? Looks like if we look at the yellow bits on the bottom. There we go. Unfortunately, we're going to need one there. And one there. So it's still going a little bit gloomy in the end, but this main area here is doing quite well. But we are struggling for power. We don't actually have the money to be able to put that in. So hopefully some more people are going to come on in. Oh, we've got no power for our ticket machine either. How much do we need? It's 300, I believe, isn't it? Right, 221. Come on. Can we get that train in? Are we going to be able to sneakily get that in? Yes, there we go. So it's toggling how much power is getting used by different things at the moment. Oh, both of these are now out of power. Come on, train, get out of the way, because I need to put another generator in. How many generators? We've already got four generators going. Why are we not on the national grid? Ah, 305, there we go. Generator. Right, we have five pounds to our name. A fiver, and that is it. To our name. Oh, no, 75 now. So our bin is starting to fill up. I do want to put some plants in. I do want to get the newspaper stand in. At the moment, we need to just concentrate on making up as much money as we want. Come on, give me the power. There we go. Yeah, just about got it in. Six o'clock in the evening. We're back at rush hour. We are making some more money. So when we get, get another 300, it looks like we're going to need to put another generator in. Maybe we made this a little bit too big to get ourselves started. Maybe. 
because that's where the next 300 is going in. So we're getting lots of bonds in here, 20 bonds. Can we actually put a better gen? Can we get a better generator? Level two generator. Yeah, we can get a level two one. Capacitor. Let's look at that. We never did that last time. So let's procure that. And have a look at our utilities. No, that's tools. Here we go. Utilities. Capacitor. That's £150. So we're going to need to put another generator in. And let's put a capacitor in. So when the place isn't actually using the power as much we can start storing it which should really help us and we got a bond in so that's giving us a thousand a thousand pounds that's going to help we're about to come to our first night time so we'll wait till night time and then we'll start adding in more parts right here we go it is now night time so just quickly skip for a little bit there of just the general day-to-day -day things there of them coming in. Right, we need to get ourselves... Power seems to be now sorted, which is really, really good. Now we've got that capacitor in. Let's put a few more chairs in. And I want to put some chairs over this side. I want them using this side. So one, two, three... Four. Okay, we'll, we'll put a fourth in. Let's get a newspaper stand in because we had some people complaining about not having a newspaper. Let's put a newspaper stand in there. And I like to put some ads in. How much have we got? 162. Right, we're only going to put the one in because we are going to end up running out of money. And I don't want Chloe here going on strike. So she's just going to quickly refuel these, empty the trash, and get ourselves ready for tomorrow. We are going to need to put a mop in as well. Can we do that yet? Is that something... I haven't seen that's something we need to do yet. How many points bonds have we got? 20 bonds. Let's just have a quick look through. We've got an alarm. We've got a fan. An air vent. Um, three more points signaling what does this do map platforms to a numeric key press oh so if we put that in it does mean we need to put a room in though for that if we put a room in for that then we can just press a button on our keyboard rather than having to click down here but we're okay during the day at the moment what tools have we got here a megaphone well we've got the pa system down here so we don't really need that Soon we're going to need the first aid kit, watering can, jerry can, tool kit. So we'll put some plants in very shortly. Newspaper stand. So we've got some other things here that we can unlock soon. Cash machine, drinks machine, a phone box, Chris machine, and then we can get the ads when we unlock those. Okay. And we've got everything that we can in here. Right, okay. So let's let her rest up and we'll come back in the morning. Right, there we go. We're on day number two. Let's get the first train in. Now, we couldn't actually fill all the generators. This one here needed a bit more fuel. So we needed to wait till the morning until we could fill that one up. But that's not, I'm hoping that's not going to be too much of an issue now we are very very low on money now our bins did get empty but we couldn't empty that bin there we're gonna need to put a bin over this side but we need to start taking some more cash off these guys so we need to need people to keep on coming in come on get boarded at least we have managed to get it emptied. Right, let's check the reports. What are people complaining about? Bad shopping range. There's not a lot I can do about that. Overcrowded. Gloomy. Well, facilities not powered. That shouldn't be a problem today. I think we've sorted the power. Need more prestige. Prices are high. Well, I can't really help you with that. So overall, not too bad. Fumes, again, I can't actually do anything about that at the moment. 
So until we can actually put the air vents in, where were the air vents? Air vents, yeah, until I can put the air vents in, there's not a lot I can really do about that. So I can't put these in yet. So the only thing I can really do is put in a couple of plants for them. She's just done a bit more refilling. 334 pounds right we need to get a bin level one bin we need to get a bin this side come on get the train in there we go i don't think it's worth putting in a signal room just yet until i can do the thing that does it automatically so then i haven't got to think about it i don't think it's really needed we're going to have to be very careful with our money here are we close to another grant build two platforms so when we build the second platform we'll get another thousand pounds if we get up to 75 percent we'll get 900 so we're at 66 we're not doing too bad hopefully that's going up rather than down Chloe seems to be doing everything there she's just had to do some repairing so to go up, I think we're going to need to get some plants in. Yeah, I think, I think we're going to need to get some plants in. So let's get you in and we'll get the watering can. How much was that plant? Right, let's get the train in. Tell me how much the plant was to put in. Level one plant. Do you tell me how much? More technology has been unlocked. Okay, beautiful. We'll go and have a look at that in two minutes. Let's put two plants there. What have we unlocked? I wish you'd tell me what has been unlocked. Ah, here we go. So we've got the cash machine. So we'll procure that a drinks machine that takes one bond and cash machine and we've got a phone box here as well okay let's go all out i'm not gonna get the ads straight away for them even though they would help do we think the cash machine is going to be all oh, train oh my god why are people shouting oh we've got a rat Oh, that's not good. Pause. Let's look at our tools. Can I get... Oh, we got loads of things that have now been unlocked. Right, we need to get the rat killer. Okay. And I think a map would be useful. And she's going to need... First. She's going to have to... Well, we might need to get another member of staff. She's going to have to do everything. Right. Tools. Let's get this rat killer. 150 pounds. Oh no, now we're struggling with power. Right. You're going to have to choose your power wisely now. Ah! Come on, we need your refueling. Don't worry about that. So, ah, that's why. Okay. Fuel go to number two for a second. Let's put everything to number two. Apart from the rats. Because that is that is what we need. Right, un, unpause. Need to sort these rats out. Right, she's going to get in the rat prodder. Right, there's a rat over here. Come on. Come and get it. Where are you going? What are you going to? Come on, kill it. Oh, there we go. That's one. Oh, there's another one up here. This ain't going to help our reputation, is it? Yes. Look at that. You need a toilet. 346. Right. Can we put some stuff in to keep these people happy? Drinks machine. 250, right? Drinks machine. Uh, yeah. 250. Let's put a drinks machine in. 
as we all know how important our hydration is. How is our power doing? We check on our power grid. Power levels. Power needed 7.7. .7. And we can make 132. We should be absolutely fine for power then. Yeah, we should be absolutely fine. Yeah, we're fine for power. Right. Now, we are out of fuel, though. So we're out of fuel. So these three now can't be refilled. But we've got those three going. We've got the capacitor now. So it shouldn't be too bad. She's going off for a short rest. Right, I'm going to carry on calling the trains in until we get into our second night time. Right, here we go. So I've just looked at our report sheet and we have a lot of people that are lost. The rats should not be a problem anymore. Toilets and bad shopping range. Now, we've got a little bit of money, not loads though. So if we have a quick look at what we can do here, where is our map? Where did my map go? I saw it a minute ago. Yep, the end of the day. Thank you. We just looked at that. Level 1 map. No, that's our mop. Okay, we've got that. Have we not unlocked? Let's get that in. £125. Okay. And a first aid kit as well. There we go. So we're starting to fill up our tool room now. Can we get a map? So we've got the mop there, facilities, level two plant. Ah, here we go, map. Because we had a lot of people that were getting lost. So let's get a map. Ah, it has to go on a wall. Okay. Right, well, let's £200 for a map. Jesus. Taking the P155 there. Okay, so we've got a map over here. I assume that just covers those green tiles there, which really means that we could do with one over here. Um, uh, or maybe just over here. Okay, we'll put one there as well. Right. Now, we need to look at Chloe. Sign a job. Medical, and we'll put the mopping to number two as well. Put litter picking back to number one. So rat and litter picking are the most important, and the jerry can. There we go. So she's starting to get quite a few responsibilities now. So we might have to look at another member of staff at some point. Applicants. Well, we've got a couple of applicants here. Can we afford these, though? You're not very good on stamina. You're not very good on stamina. I think we're going to wait until we open up downstairs. Right. Let her carry on through the night time, and we're going to come back in the morning and see how we get on with day number three. Right, now this is good news. Chloe has leveled up. So, can we... Yep, bring you up here. So we can now increase one of these. Now, her perception is very good anyway. Her stamina. Strength is pretty good. She can actually carry four things at a time, which is probably good enough. Should we just... In Let's increase her speed. Level up. There we go. So, in fact, yeah, we're definitely going to be fine with Chloe just on this level. We'll probably get another one. Now, we need more fuel. Now, fuel is becoming a problem. That is going to refill. There we go. 7 o'clock. cock -a doodle do is going to refill. But she's going to use most of that fuel doing those. So... How much was a fuel can? 100. Well, we can't even buy one if we wanted to. But the trash can, the wheelie bin, it seems okay. You have a rodent problem. Well, that's not good news. Not good news at all. There it is. It's coming in from the streets. Right, yeah, she's getting the rodent product because that is number one. 
We're still at 65% though for the happiness. We need to get that to 75 though. We need that money. Oh, it'd be good if I got the train in. There we go. Go on. Zap it. Come on. There we go. Uh, only a few people had to put up with that rant. Are you going to clean it up though? Also rest. Does that mean you're off to the class classroom? You're off to the staff room. There you go. Get yourself a drink. Get yourself hydrated. We need to... £100. Right. Let's get ourselves another fuel barrel. I don't want power becoming an issue. There we go. Now... When we get to 250 again, I think the most important thing is going to be probably a cash machine or a drinks machine. How much is a cash machine? 225 and a crisp machine. Right, let's get the train in. Let's get a crisp machine in. Should we put them next to each other or should we... We'll spread them out and we'll put some adverts in between. When we have the money to do that. So what's, you need a cash machine. Have a look over here. High prices. Bad shopping range. That should be coming down now. Because we've just put some more in. Rats. No toilets. Okay. Have a quick look at our reports. Our procurements. Uh, utilities. Air vents. Right. That'll be good. Let's get that one done. We've got 15 bonds. 17 bonds now. Okay, we've just gone up. Phone box. Right, let's get the ads for the drinks and the Chris. Come on. There we go. Right, let's go back into this infrastructure should we put a third carriage on how many bonds is that four bonds let's do that entrance staircase one bond right we'll do that ready for when we put our next one in downstairs utilities no i think we're gonna be fine with that where can we get toilets Oh, we can actually get a medicine cabinet for her and a TV set. Okay, we'll have a look at that for Chloe in a bit. Where would the toilets be? I'd imagine under facilities, level 2 plant. You get a better bench. Ah, here we go, toilets. Five bonds for some toilets. Ooh, and they're probably going to be expensive to put in as well. Some level 2 plants, though, will give us a bit more prestige, but we don't seem to be having. Prestige is a very small one here. It's the shopping range and the toilets are a big one. Okay, guys, well, we're running out of time for today. We have got our third carriage on, though, which is fantastic. Chloe is doing okay. That guy was lost, so we're getting some plus ones here. We're up to 68%. So I'm going to have to leave you guys from this one. Thank you very much for joining us today. And in the next episode, we are going to get our, get our happiness, our reputation here up to 75%. He's walking around lost. Get a few more machines in, get our ATM in, and then look at hooking up our next platform. So thank you very much for joining me, guys. As always, big thumbs up on the video. Any comments, put those down below. And we'll catch you guys in the next episode. Take it easy, guys. See you later.